Top 5 Muscular Women in the World, Part 23 Hello all gymnastics and martial arts enthusiasts in the world. I am Keisha, and welcome back to the series of the most wonderful female bodybuilders in the world. All of them did have a great journey to bodybuilding. Fantastic, right? Then, come on, let's go and find out more. Number 4. Brigida Brezovac The second female bodybuilder today is Brigida Brezovac, a retired Slovenian professional bodybuilder. Brigida was born on September 24, 1979, in Ludomer, Slovenia. She attended the Sedua School in Merska Soboda, Slovenia, and the University of Maribor. Brigida has a height of 5 feet 4 inches. Currently, she weighs around 150 pounds. Wow, look at her biceps. They are so big and ripped. At 14, Brigida went to a boyfriend's gym. Accidentally, she saw the photos of Kari Everson and Inga Langer and decided to be a bodybuilder. Three months later, Brigida competed for the first time at the 2001 World Championship. Then, in 2004, at the World Championship to bodybuilding category because she was too muscular. Since then, she has competed in more bodybuilding contests. In 2013, Brigida retired from bodybuilding. Besides bodybuilding, Brigida also takes up karate, taekwondo, and boxing. Number 3. Tony West And now, the third female bodybuilder today is Tony West, an IFBB pro. Tony was born in 1979. She has now been 42, but still remains in good shape. Tony has a standard height of 5 feet 6 inches. She was involved in fitness from an early age. However, at college, she got injured in a soccer match. That was when she moved to weightlifting and then bodybuilding. In 2003, she attended her first show and got first position. Then, she got pregnant and gained 65 pounds. Long time later, she decided to get back into competitive bodybuilding. In 2007, she entered the NPC Pennsylvania Championships. She then competed more, until 2009, at the WNBF Pro Natural US Cup. Tony was able to get the pro card. However, after the 2010 competitions, she took some years off as her sister was diagnosed with Hodgkin's lymphoma. She returned in 2013 with the first place at the IFBB Toronto Pro. So fantastic! Number 2. Natalia Yaris And now, let's meet Natalia Yaris, a female bodybuilder of Russian origin. Natalia was born in the year of 1979. Wow, look at her green eyes. They make her so attractive. Besides, her slightly curly brown hair has added to her muscular beauty. I am sure many people here really want to know how she can get such a good shape. Natalia first joined bodybuilding competition in 2006. It was at the Six Games of the People of Siberia, and she got fifth place. A year later, she attended the 2007 Siberian Federal District Powerlifting Championships and placed second. Wonderful! She then took some years off for better physique. She came back in 2011 at the European Amateur Championships in the category of heavyweight. 
In 2013, she participated in two competitions, which are the Arnold Classic Europe and the Russian Bodybuilding Championships. Number one, Diana Cato. Diana Cato was born on June 2, 1966, in Haiti. She then immigrated to Canada, where she started her bodybuilding career. Currently, she weighs around 155 pounds. Although Diana is only 5 feet 2.5 inches in height, her full, sweeping, and beautifully proportioned muscles really make men jealous. Along with that, her ability to get into superb condition are the main reason for her nicknames as the gift, the Che Cutler of women's bodybuilding, the flex wheeler of female bodybuilding. At first, Diana did not find a bodybuilding physique attractive. However, her mind was changed when she attended a bodybuilding show with a person she knew at a gym. Her first bodybuilding contest was in 1992, where she won the Quebec Metropolitan. Cadeau earned her pro card in 1997 by winning the overall title at the Canada Cup. Then, the year 2004 was her most successful year in the sport, with her winning the lightweight title in the Miss International and Miss Olympia. She remained in the top 6 in every IFBB Pro competition. Still, in 2011, Cato announced that she retired from bodybuilding and only joined physique. Currently, Cato is the most successful Canadian bodybuilder in the world by being the only Canadian to win the Miss Olympia lightweight. She is now living in Wilton Manors, Florida. Besides being a professional bodybuilder and physique contestant, she works as a legal assistant, promoter, NPC judge, adult model, and personal trainer. In January 2008, she founded Yana M. Cado Inc. So guys, our 5 female bodybuilders today are so great, right? Leave your comment below to let us know. Many thanks for your attention to this video. And now, see you later.